Sure, here are some tips for growing flowers. One, asterisk, asterisk. Choose the right location. Most flowers need plenty of sunlight, so select a spot in your garden that gets at least six, eight hours of direct sunlight a day. Some flowers, like impatiens or begonias, can tolerate shade. Two, asterisk, asterisk, prepare the soil. Ensure your soil is well-draining and nutrient-rich. You can improve soil quality by adding compost or organic matter before planting. Three, asterisk, asterisk, watering, asterisk, asterisk. Water your flowers deeply but infrequently rather than shallowly and frequently. This encourages deeper root growth. Avoid overhead watering to prevent diseases. Four, asterisk, asterisk, mulching. Asterisk, asterisk. Apply a layer of mulch around your flowers to help retain moisture, suppress weeds, and regulate soil temperature. Five, asterisk, asterisk. Fertilizing, asterisk, asterisk. Depending on the type of flowers you're growing, fertilize them periodically during the growing season with a balanced fertilizer. Follow the instructions on the fertilizer package for application rates. Six, asterisk, asterisk. Deadheading, asterisk, asterisk. Remove spent flowers, deadheading, regularly to promote continuous blooming. This also helps redirect the plant's energy into producing more flowers. Seven, asterisk, asterisk, pest and disease control. Keep an eye out for pests like aphids or diseases like powdery mildew. Use organic methods or appropriate pesticides if necessary, following instructions carefully. Eight, asterisk, asterisk. Support and staking. Some taller or heavy flowering plants may need support or staking to keep them upright and prevent damage. Nine, asterisk, asterisk. Pruning, asterisk, asterisk, trim back, leggy growth, or prune dead diseased branches to maintain plant health and shape. 10, asterisk, asterisk, seasonal care. Different flowers have different needs throughout the seasons. Understand the specific requirements of the flowers you're growing and adjust care accordingly. By following these tips, you can enhance the health and beauty of your flower garden. Timing is crucial when it comes to planting seeds. Here are some tips to help you get it right. One, know your frost dates. Find out the average last frost date in your area for spring planting and the first frost date for fall planting. This helps you plan when to start seeds indoors or directly sow them outdoors. Two, read seed packets. Seed packets often provide guidance on when to plant based on your location. They may suggest starting indoors a certain number of weeks before the last frost date or direct seeding after the last frost. Three, start indoors wisely. For plants that require a long growing season or are sensitive to cold, start seeds indoors several weeks before the last frost date. This allows seedlings to be ready for transplanting once the weather warms up. Four. Direct sow for hardy plants. Some seeds, like root crops, carrots, radishes, and certain herbs, basil, cilantro, are best sown directly into the ground as they don't transplant well. Wait until after the last frost date and when soil temperatures are suitable. Five, consider soil temperature. Seeds germinate best when the soil temperature is right for them Use a soil thermometer to monitor soil temperature and plant seeds when it's within the recommended range for each type of plant. Six, check moisture and weather. Ensure the soil is moist but not waterlogged when planting seeds. Keep an eye on the weather forecast to avoid planting seeds just before a heavy rain or during a cold spell. Seven, succession. Planting. To extend your harvest, plant seeds in batches every few weeks rather than all at once. This staggered planting ensures a continuous supply of fresh produce throughout the growing season. Eight, 
use a gardening calendar. Keep a gardening calendar or use a gardening app to schedule planting times, record observations, and plan for future seasons based on your local climate and growing conditions. By paying attention to these timing tips, you can maximize the success of your seed planting and enjoy a bountiful garden throughout the year.